Hi everyone, welcome on board to Cat King. This is Anisha here and we have another uh, most awaited college. Finally, the PI shortlist has come out. A lot of students have been contemplating whether they received the mail or not despite meeting sectional cutoffs or overall cutoffs which usually IMI has. So what you need to do is check your emails. So IMI Delhi has released their shortlist today itself. It has been sent out over an email to the students. Let me quickly walk you guys through the complete email that has been come out today. So if you check out, this is how your email looks like. Okay, so they have sent out an email to everybody which says, congratulations based on your application program preference, you have been shortlisted for the PGDM programs based on the ones which you have taken up, right? So this one's shortlisted for banking and financial services, the PGDM and the PGDM HR programs, all of them. Okay, to get an update on the latest developments of IMI Delhi, you can refer to the final placements. Well, honestly, for any college, this is what I have been always telling you before as well. Before going in for the interviews, you will read up the complete website. What's it in news for? What are they doing? Check out for interview experiences or also on the Cat Kings website to understand kiss type ke interviews happen and placement report that we have to see. So I will walk you guys through the placement report as well today. We will see it together. But what's the next step ahead for us? Okay, so here if it's mentioned. To participate in this selection process, you are now required to select your preferred date and time slot for the personal assessment process. Okay, The portal will be open at 10 a.m. on 11th February and close by 10 a.m. on 14th February. So that means you only have this weekend. Today, tomorrow and Sunday. Monday, subah, 10 baje tak koi zarat nahi hai. early morning tak last minute pe wait karne ki. Book your slots at the earliest because at the end of it, it is first come first basis, right? Don't face the issues key slots got over. Like a lot of students do not have slots for symbiosis. Now college is going to allocate them slots because they didn't book it well in time, right? So make sure you book your slots at the earliest. Your preference for the date and time will be confirmed to you by a separate letter on 15th February. So once you have booked your time, 15th Feb, you will get your confirmation of your date and time allocation as well also, okay? very important what all documents do you need while booking this slot good thing they have given it before itself so tum ye documents pehle ready rakho taki just have to upload book and get done with it you need your cat zat gmat scorecards 10th and 12th mark sheet graduation mark sheet proof of work experience certificate for work experience candidates only work experience ka proof is usually a work experience letter if you don't have that then your Offer letter and the last three months salary slips works for it. And the duly filled personal interview form which is available on your admission portal itself. Once you log in, you will get that. Okay? Clearly they have mentioned if you do not upload any of the documents, you will not be allowed to book your personal assessment form slots at, the, at that end. right? So do not miss out your timelines. Please follow the guidelines and submit it well in time right now let's have a quick look at the final placement report which is there so we look at the placement report of the pgdm program first to see what is the whole scenario right now at imi new delhi right so looking at the placement stats you can see highest has been 32 lakhs average has been at 15.48 lakhs Median is 15.11 lakhs, which is doing very good, right? The top 10% median is 23.49 lakhs, okay? And the top 10% ka, uh, sorry, top 10% ka average is 23.49 and the median is 21.27 lakhs per annum. Top 25% has average at 20.08 and the median at 18.2. 20 lakhs per annum right so that's your placement cup summary of the stats if you look at the batch profile currently the batch profile of this batch is you can see the educational background may we have maximum engineers yes 56 percent engineers 29 percent from commerce 8 percent from science 7 percent from other background right and we also have people uh, from various work experience sector as well. The batch strength is 243 
work experience wise maximum of freshers 52 percent freshers 12 to 24 months we have 17 percent people then 1 to 12 months we have 12 percent people 24 to 36 months we have 11 percent more than 36 months we have 8 percent gender diversity thoda sa is very skewed i mean this should definitely have been better male 84 percent and female 18 percent so i think we should have more females applying in and that should help you you know in doing getting a better diversity in the batch profile that helps in the placements also in fact some of the top recruiters which have been coming on board we have cap gemini dell deloitte vedanta coming tres vistas rpg bank of america asian pains grant thornton gb a lot of good companies you also have your consulting giants like bcg eny also coming so good stream of people have been coming we have people from it its telecom banking and financial sectors consulting fmcgs healthcare as well also though you can clearly see it's dominated by consulting and edtech secondly by it ies and telecom companies right so overall i would say the placements have been doing pretty well for the pgdm program let's look at the other two programs also which is your hrm and the banking and financial services program as well what is the batch dynamics like so when we look at the hrm program here the highest again it's showing the same stats with respect to just let me have a quick check yes this is the hr profile uh, hr placement report the batch profile we have the batch strength is 51 people female 30 percent male 70 percent educational background 41 percent engineers 10 percent commerce 37 percent from science 12 percent from other background here again we see a lot of fresher 60 percent are freshers right placement stats if you look at it highest is 32 average is 15 and median is 13.11 so this is important 51 ka batch hai chota batch size hai so this placement stats are still good for that as well right if you look at the pgdm banking and financial sector also even this is a very small batch 47 students only right 47 students may say 19 percent female 81 percent male these 47 students again 49 percent are engineers right 38 percent are from science and we have nine percent from other background and four percent from commerce this is pretty surprising like the stat um, the financial sector service having lesser people from commerce but i think it depends on what kind of choice you are making maximum freshers 53 percent and a good chunk of people with 12 to 24 months of experience as well if you look at the placement highlights for this batch which is there highest is 19.47 lakhs average is 14.3 and the median is 14.09 lakhs per annum right so overall i would say it's a good college doing very well imi delhi has been famous for a long time it has a legacy which is going on there and it's located very close to your ifts and fms so you have a good peer learning exposure coming in from delhi and you know also the entire delhi ncr region all you need to do is now focus on your college conversions right so make sure you are attending your everyday 9 to 10 pm lectures get your basic concepts for marketing finance strategy sorted out your how to prepare interview answers all the expected interview questions are being discussed in the class as well and getting you geared up for current affairs knowledge which is very important because most interviews revolve around current affairs and how would you handle the current scenario situations very importantly focusing on how to build your opinion for these kind of situations right so we'll take care of training you in that and get access to the complete dashboard as well which has all the interview experiences functional dossiers make sure you do not skip out on starting up that sessions today all right for people who have not yet started finance friday sessions going to be happening today 9 pm tonight so get on board before that and that's something which is good for not just people who are in finance even any stream people so that you can understand basic questions of finance or budget which is expected for each one of us all right stay tuned to the channel for updates about all the college their application process if any particular college you want us to help you in the interview preparation, drop in the comments and we'll take that up for you. Bye-bye. Take care.